everyone welcome to simply Learn's youtube channel today we will learn how to build a funnel chart in excel that said if these are the type of videos you'd like to watch then hit that like and subscribe buttons and the bell icon to get notified just for a quick info if you want to upskill yourself master business analytics skills and land your dream job or grow in your career then you must explore simply learn's code of various business analytics programs simply learn offers postgraduate programs from third year university in collaboration with Microsoft, Amazon, and Google. Through this program, you will gain knowledge and work ready expertise in skills like prescriptive and predictive analytics, regression, classification, and over a dozen others. That's not all, you also get the opportunity to work on multiple projects and learn from industry experts in top tier product companies and academics from top universities. After completing these courses, Thousands of learners have transitioned into a business analytics role as a fresher or moved on to a higher paying job profile. If you are passionate about making your career in this field, then make sure to check out the link in the pinned comment and description box below to find the business analytics program that fits your experience and areas of interest. Now without further delay, over to our training. Now we are on the Microsoft Excel spreadsheet and here I have some sales data. So we have row ID, order ID, ship date, ship mode, etc. So what we are up to is to create a funnel chart. So before we create a funnel chart, let's try to get some data, right? So let's create a pivot table and you know, we have a row or column named as region. So let's create five different rows which have the data related to North, East, South, West and Central regions. And let's try to find out the highest number of sales from a particular region that is why we are going to sort and then let's copy the data from the pivot table to a new sheet because pivot table will not allow you to create a funnel chart so let's try to add those data into a new spreadsheet and let's create a funnel chart of it so basically funnel chart looks like a bar chart and the only difference is the shape of the bars if you see them vertically or horizontally the way you're putting it then you can find out it takes a shape of a funnel so with that briefing let's get started now just select any cell on the spreadsheet go to the insert menu and there click on the pivot table from the stable range so excel will automatically select the range and you can see the range got highlighted with the dotted lines and select the new worksheet option and there you go and now you have the pivot table ready and now you might want to add some data on your pivot table right so here is the field list so in case if you don't find the field list you can find it in the pivot table analyze show button and now we want two sections the first one is region let's pull the region to rows the next one can be anything it could be profit discount quantity sales so let's go with the sales according to our initial plan finding out the sale and the regions so you can uh, check if the aggregation is sum or not basically sometimes you might get count or average so we wanted sum so it's exactly the sum and now you can you know select any cell and right click to sort it largest to smallest now you have the sorted list now select your data copy and go to the new sheet paste this here and now go to the insert option once again and now expand the charts option and automatically you have recommended charts on the front and here the funnel chart is one of the recommendations just click on that press ok and now you have the funnel chart you can uh, you know change the title to region wise you can also edit your chart so let's say this is currency right so you can go to the data types and here go to currency and change rupees to dollars since the data set has dollars united states english dollars okay and if you want to get rid of the decimal points you can also do that and uh, yeah you can also change the colors by getting into the colors option you can fill different colors to different regions and uh, yeah so far so good so you can see central region has the highest number of sales and with that we have come to an end of the session on how to create funnel chart in excel if you have any queries regarding any of the topics covered in this session or if you require 
the data set that we have used in this session please do let us know in the comment section below and our team of experts will be happy to resolve all the queries and the earliest until next time thank you for watching and stay tuned for more from simply learn staying ahead in your career requires continuous learning and upskilling whether you're a student aiming to learn today's top skills or a working professional looking to advance your career, we've got you covered. Explore our impressive catalog of certification programs in cutting edge domains, including data science, cloud computing, cybersecurity, AI, machine learning, or digital marketing. Designed in collaboration with leading universities and top corporations, and delivered by industry experts. Choose any of our programs and set yourself on the path to career success. Click the link in the description to know more. Hi there, if you like this video, subscribe to the Simply Learn YouTube channel and click here to watch similar videos. To nerd up and get certified, click here.